Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create lines with multiple strokes in Illustrator by taking advantage of the appearance panel. On my screen in my Illustrator document I have a single stroke. It is four points. It is black and I'm going to do a few things to it to make it a little bit more interesting. So I've got my strokes panel open on the right hand side of the screen and the first thing that I think I'm going to do is add a dashed line, which is as easy as selecting the dashed line checkbox and seeing what, um, what version of a dashed line we have in there already. Mine's a 15 point dash, and um, so I think I'll just keep this. And so if I would like to create um, a, another type of dashed line, uh, I could always just add a gap and a, a different size dash and a different size gap and that would give me um, a more interesting um, dashed line but if what I'd like to do is to create a line that's somewhat thicker and has uh, even more interesting properties then I can use my appearance panel to do that and add a different stroke um, so to get to the appearance panel I'm going to the Windows drop down menu and click on appearance and I see that the appearance of the stroke that I currently have selected is as we can see a stroke that's black four point dashed and it has no fill so if I'd like to add another stroke below the stroke that I already have I'm going to select the fill layer and then come either down to the left hand side of this appearance panel and add a new stroke or go to the upper right hand side of the appearance panel and use the appearance panel menu and add a new stroke. So this new stroke is now underneath my original stroke and I'm just going to change the um, the color of it so we can see what's going on. Now let's pick blue and I'm going to increase the stroke to um, seven points. So what this has done is it has created a blue dashed stroke that lies right underneath my black dashed stroke. So if I like this effect I can save it as a new graphic style so I can reuse it on a different stroke later. To do that um, I've got the graphic styles panel open which I access from the window drop down menu and to create a new graphic style all I have to do is have something selected that I've um, changed the appearance on and click the new graphic style at the bottom of the graphic styles panel and then double click to name this black dash with blue outline okay so if I want to get even fancier with that I could add another stroke so this time what I'm going to do is again go over to my appearance panel and click on fill so when I add a new stroke it is at the bottom of the stroke stack that I'm working on. This time I'm going to add a new stroke by using the add a new stroke icon in the bottom left of the appearance panel and I'm going to click on my stroke panel options for this and unselect dashed line um, and then I'm going to change the stroke color to black and increase the stroke weight so it goes beyond the the um, other two strokes that I had. So if I like this then I can again create a new graphic style from it and I'm going to do that and then double click to name it and I will call this um, black dash blue outline black background so as you can see it is really easy to create a new graphic style and you, to use a graphic style all you have to do is draw out a new stroke and select the graphic style that you'd like to apply to it and if you don't like what you have you can create another one